hey guys uh, welcome back to my channel welcome back to learn in a nutshell so in the previous video we're looking uh, into send grid uh, mails you know and also we checked out how to send mail with uh, dynamic templates send grids dynamic template wherein you can uh, send uh, you know predefined designs which have done there and pass uh, parameters to that uh, so that we can dynamically change the content and send the mail so that's done in the previous video if you have not checked that out you can definitely check that out so in this video we will talk about attachments how to send a simple attachment uh, via the mail we'll use um, the dynamic uh, template itself for this one also and uh, we can do the same thing with uh, the normal template as well um, normal template when i say the normal draft as well so for this what we'll be doing is we will um, create a simple attachment uh, a json at, uh, json file for this so let me create a variable called attach and uh, pass similar uh, json variable let me give sharukh khan itself for this as well and also let's provide um, native just randomly giving some value so let's give delhi so the json is ready now we need to send it as an attachment so for that what you can do is uh, let's create something called as buffer need to convert into buffer and send it so buffer dot from and add that attachment and also I can provide the encoding what kind of encoding this needs to have type of encoding it requires let me select uh, UTF-8 and let's convert it into to string base 64 encoding so to string and provide base 64 here so this is done but this will give an error because we are sending attachment as json itself so it will not be able to read it so what we'll do is let's uh, stringify this json dot stringify and provide this json and also let's uh, uh, beautify this one also let's provide null and provide two indents so this is also done now what you have to do is we'll have to uh, create an attachment draft attachment draft uh, and uh, we need to provide something called as contents and uh, in, in this content you need to pass the you need to pass the buffer and then you can provide the file name as well you can pass any dynamic name if you need i'll just provide one normal name um user details dot json has it's a json file so what am i doing json and then also pass the type so it's application slash json is the file type and you need to pass disposition also disposition has attachment so that the mail understands it's an attachment so this is for uh, one attachment if there are multiple attachment you need to push it to an array if there is a single attachment also it needs to be in a, in an array so let me give the name as attachment and you can directly put 
the square bracket here but i'm just showing uh, this method in case you have multiple attachments to push push then you can do this uh, you know in this way you can push it attachment dot push of attachment draft so it will push this particular draft if there are multiple you can push it using a for loop or something and this data will be pushed to this attachment and this attachment you just need to pass in this um, mail draft it should be attachments and pass this attachment now let's see if uh, this you now sends out successfully so mail has uh, gone successfully let's see if it has come up here so you can see that all the details are coming with an attachment as well if you open you'll see the template coming up here uh, with a dynamic variable name called Shahrukh Khan also let's open this JSON and you can see the JSON which we created there has come up here as well so that's how you send an attachment using SendGrid and uh, you can do that same thing uh, you know by uh, passing this as well let me cut it from here and put this thing here and let me comment this out and along with this detail let me pass attachments here oh sorry attachment now let's see if the attachment goes with plain uh, you know body email the email has gone successfully and the email has come here as well and if you see there is an attachment coming uh, which has come up here it's the same thing with other details like hi team hope you are doing good so yeah that's about it that's how you attach a attachment in a mail hope you have understood if you have not understood or if you're stuck somewhere let me know that in the comment section and also if you liked it please do the like button subscribe uh, please uh, do post your valuable comments uh, let's catch again next video thank you so much guys bye